In other news, the bulk carrier Octopus sunk near the entrance to the Cassidy Creek off the coast of the Great Ocean Highway. The vessel issued a SOS on Sunday morning at 4.8 a.m. during a heavy storm in the area. The U.S. Coast Guard, along with the San Andreas Ministry of Natural Resources, responded to the SOS and deployed rescue efforts from the Polito Bay Station. All crew members were rescued except the Octopus's captain, who refused to leave his ship. It is unknown why Fort St. Kuda, despite being the nearest rescuers, failed to deploy rescue efforts. A Fort St. Kuda spokesperson declined to give a comment on why no efforts were made to rescue the Octopus's crew. After the crew members being rescued, the Octopus sank rather quickly and is now resting in an underwater ravine. It is still unknown why the Octopus sank, but officials from the U.S. Coast Guard, along with the Ministry of Natural Resources, are working to discover why the Octopus sank and took a lifeboat.